over go you are second to any bonus reading for september it's going to be a six ways so congrats your second place how's everybody doing today good good i'm sorry about you you know whoever it is that like broke their leg or some shit someone broke their leg i guess that's what ditzy just said anyway um, anyway, Virgo, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. There's going to be two readings, one for you, one for the other person, group one, group two. Figure out who you are and decide that you're not the shittier person between the two of you, right? Which usually works, but Cancer's was kind of confusing. I don't know, Cancer was kind of like going back and forth with themselves, it felt like. It was more like a reading for their two halves, their light side and their dark side. So I don't know. We're going to see what's coming up with you, right? Right. Anyway, um, this resonates with you a good deal. If not, don't worry about it. It's just a card game after all. Won't work if you don't believe on it. So boop your nose and let's go. If you want a personal reading after this, my email, Facebook, and Instagram are all down below. First readings on the house and everything else comes with a price. And donations and tips are very much welcome my way. Thank you very kindly in advance. Now... Group one, you have four of pentacles reversed. There was a connection that you held as golden, but now you're realizing you're losing yourself to it a little bit, I feel like. Ooh, yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Four of wands right there. That's the situation, a separation between you and somebody you connect with, right? Your wants and wishes, Leo, Sag, Aries, something passionate. Booty card man's here. Someone's looking for booty. Someone wants to take that passionate action, get something done. Um, the obstacle and challenge against you is someone's like you might feel like you're not getting as, as many blessings as you think you deserve, or you feel like someone's outshining you somehow. Mm. Interesting. Fears and rejections is wasting time. I, I feel you on that, man. I know exactly. Like, you know, as an earth sign, I totally get the whole wasting time thing. But that's something you're fearing or rejecting, so I don't know which one you're doing just yet, group one. What brings this shit full circle? What goes around comes around. How it started, how it'll end. I feel like somebody's trying to put on a performance and it's not working for them. They're trying to balance themselves out, but unfortunately they're hanging off of those pentacles rather than um, doing anything with them. It's like, it'd be like finances instead of like using your paychecks the way you want to or like save enough for shit. This person is almost living paycheck to paycheck, like struggling to hang on to those pentacles rather than like, you know, um, letting it flow like energy, you know, like money's just another frequency, another volume. Like a lot of people, I don't know, people will argue with me about it, but I do feel like, you know, if you don't fucking worry about the money you're getting, you end up getting more. It's kind of like when you, uh, it's what, it's like when you're looking for weed from somebody, you know, from back in the day, right? Like, you look all day, but then it's like, as soon as you get some, everybody's fucking offering you some because you don't need it. And, and, and money kind of works that way, too. If you don't worry about needing it so much, it kind of, it, it just kind of comes to you. Um, you're not putting your energy into wanting it, you're just accepting what is, which is like the biggest thing about manifestation, right? Which is something I'm still learning. I'm, I don't, I, like, I can manifest shit, but usually the way I manifest stuff is, like, I don't mean to. Ten of Wands, someone is burdened, dragging some shit behind them, and they're ready to be done. They're just like, I'm tired of carrying this goddamn weight. I do everything around here. And I'm sick of not being appreciated, which I feel like is part of the Three of Pentacles as well. So let's see, a group one. There is a separation here and you want to take some passionate action or you're dealing with somebody who's a fire sign who wants passionate action because it feels like they're hanging on to these pentacles too much and they're putting on almost a show. This person feel re is realizing they're putting themselves in second place while they watch everybody else get what's going on around them and they feel like they've been wasting their time and that's part of the burden as well. See, yours is way easier to pick up than cancers, and I have no idea what the fuck I was up with cancers. I don't know. Like, cancer it was just weird, and I don't know why it was so hard for me to read up on that shit. But it's whatever. It's whatever. Okay. Four of pentacles reversed. Someone's realizing that they put themselves second in a... 
I, I don't even think this is really relationship shit either. It's just like a connection with a somebody or something, but that's like the wrong idea. Or maybe they were like clouded in their, um, what they were thinking. What Whatever this revelation is for them, it wasn't something dynamic. It wasn't powerful. It was just like, meh. Um, but someone still needs to recover from this, um, false idea like did someone think that they were did you all think that you were connecting with somebody and then like you found out you weren't and now you gotta like figure some shit out you know like uh, uh, there are the other four actually yeah hey crap all four just came out you know uh, opportunities and money and shit like that right that might have been what caused you to wake up a little bit Let's see. Four of fucking bonds. Reverse. Separation. Door got closed up. My cards are just doing whatever it is they want to do today, apparently. You got three cards on yours. Queen of Swords. Someone who is elusive and mystical. She gained some knowledge and now she wants to take that discipline and devotion elsewhere. As the King of Wands right here. Or this is you, group one, who um, has decided to close this door to be like quiet and stuff, like hush hush. You know, Queen of Swords makes um, rightful decisions about things. Um, she's not reversed, so that's a good thing. Um, being very, very thorough <clears throat> in what she's dealing with, and she's definitely got a lot of knowledge and insight with the coins, you know. Um, the pentacles don't represent just money. They represent anything that's of value. Education, knowledge, um, fuck, food. Food could, oh god, food sounds so good, actually. Um, oh yeah, I'm making food right now. Shit, well, I gotta get noodles on anyway, so it doesn't matter. I'm making, um, chicken alfredo, but the old-fashioned way with cream cheese and cream of chicken and... I think Italian dressing because you need that in there and broccoli and all that like someday I will teach you maybe I haven't decided yet recipes for sale two ninety nine. <laughs> as my husband said recipes for sale for two ninety nine. even though I don't know why <laughs> he's a businessman he's also a Leo so there's that king of Wands right there, and disciplined and devoted. God, I love that fucking man. Anyway, but yeah, it's like, um... This king of wands is flying away to take his discipline and devotion elsewhere after he's gained knowledge. Um, Queen is, like, interesting. This is a very interesting, group one. We got the prince of wands right here. Someone wants to take some action. Booty con, man, but it's like if they take action, they're looking towards... The hangman, and it's like a waste of their time. This is a want and wish, right? Someone would take action. No, they're they're just snooping with the flying monkeys. They're trying to figure some stuff out, but it's almost like the action they want to take is like not good, like smear campaigning, right? Page of Swords always speaks to me as a spy, but when it's reversed, it's like a really nasty one trying to start some shit. Like they want to start rumors or whatever. Maybe about you, Virgo. The fresh hell. What does this mean? Group one, Virgo. What the hell is this? What, the, what is this? Are you trying to find... Like, okay, if you're wanting passionate action in order to be able to find some Snoopy Snoop stuff out... It's interesting. Either someone's looking for information about you, Virgo, or you want to take the action to spread some info in order to make yourself a little bit more, uh... Like, you're purposely sending out, like, Group 1, you're purposely sending out information to verify what you believe you already have looked inside to know? Like, are you, like, are you spreading rumors just to see if, um... What you think's gonna happen is gonna happen? 
Like, that's some shady shit, but, like, I appreciate the game, you know? <laughs> like, that's a smart thing to do, to see if anybody's, like, really up to any bad good or no good or whatever it is you're thinking. The obstacle and challenge right now, you, it's like, group one, you're watching someone else get your blessings, and you're sitting here like, why do I only got one pentacle and I do so much? But this person's getting a bunch, right? It's like you don't want to take a leap of faith, a group one. There's nothing to explore or wonder about. It's like you don't need that clean slate. Um, King of it Cups, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. You might be... Is this this water sign you've been dealing with? Because Virgo's been dealing with a water sign for a while. And it's like... Mind you, cross watchers, switch where you need to, right? Switch where you need to with anything, actually. But it's like you are group one. It's like you don't see somebody as innocent. Is that why you're you might be going around spreading some shit? Like, someone's using their own selfish stuff to get these coins, when in reality that's not, like, innocent. That's not someone who's explorer. It's some, that, 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 like, this is, like, explorer, wanderer, you know, lets me think, you know, that it's um, somebody who's still young, naive, and shit. But this is the reverse, so I like to think that they're a little bit more experienced. Especially with the King of Cups reverse right here, using their magical powers to be a dick, I guess. That's the best way I can put it, anyway. Let's see. The Hanged Man Reverse, Group 1. Someone is afraid or rejecting, wasting their time. Knight of Coins! Once again, it could be you, Virgo, also a Capricorn, or a Taurus. Anchor, Essence, you know, and the Wheel of Fortune. Do you feel like you, you like you like you don't want to waste your time because you want to be an anchor, but the wheel of fortune is turning. Um, fate and destiny and the cycle are now coming in, and now we have the three of pentacles, where someone feels like they might be performing or watching someone perform or watching somebody struggle with pentacles or whatnot. Right? They're trying to get out of that ten of swords. They're sick of being clouded in black. Black is the night. She is the night. Because it's a waste of time. Hang my reverse once again. Someone's getting out of the situation where they're sick of just hanging out on shit or depending on this stuff. It's a waste of their time. But up here, it's like it'd be a waste of time to do anything because it's, it's like the, the wheel's turning. So it's like wherever you're anchored at, group one, if this is you, Virgo, as well, um... It is time. Like, wherever you're at, it's time to go. Because I feel like you know this. What's the ending theme? Yeah, you want out of this burden because nothing's actually going. Nothing's moving. Nothing's changing. Nothing's doing what you're expecting it to do. Something just went a ding a ling. Oh god. We're going into Virgo season with the moon and goddamn cancer at some point. There's gonna be a lot of anxiety. <laughs> that just popped up from an astrologer. That's nice. Ah, my lord. Let's see, what's this first card right here? Someone is moving on to calmer waters. They're asleep. It's just like this, take me, duck. Take me now. And the duck's like, oh, okay, well, whatever. We're going on a ride. You know, they're just going a certain direction. Someone's getting their map being like, we can go this way. We can go that way. Where do you want to go, boo? Where the fuck you want to go? We're going anywhere you want to go. You just choose the direction. You, we, we just got to watch out for this son of a bitch. Right? No, you're keeping your mouth shut. About your destinations and where you're going, or somebody is. Come in, Aquarius. A 
Gemini, Libra, you know, but it's like someone doesn't want to say anything if they don't have to. They don't want to put up a fight. Uh, now, they do have a little bit of regrets and shit when it comes to the Five of Cups, you know, but they still got their goldfish. It's like, goldfish, you're my only friend. Let's go on an adventure. And the goldfish is like, okay, where are we going, chief? Where the fuck are we going? Where can we go? What adventures can we take? What can we do, right? Once again, the hanged man. Someone sapped this tree dry, and now the fairies are going extra crazy trying to feed this person who won't fucking leave their house. Like, we can't just let him starve. Natalie, he's been here for 12 fucking years. How long are we going to feed this dude? Well, he's just a simple young man, and he needs taken care of. He's 33! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was like really stupid. I'm sorry. But it's but it's like, you know, uh that's what it feels like. It feels like someone's like taking care of somebody. And like the fairies are getting sick of it because it's just like the tree's dead. And there's nothing on this tree anymore. This person just sucked the life out of it. And there's nothing left. So it's like, uh, it's time to go, right? Right. Uh, could be a queen of wands you're dealing- Oh, god damn. Okay. Everything just flew. Could be a queen of wands you're dealing with. She might be cutting some things out, including communication right here. Someone's really trying to hold back and restrict themselves or restrain from them themselves from going beast mode and losing their shit with strength's card holding their balance or whatever like if someone was up to some sneaky shit it didn't work out wheel of fortune right here the wheel didn't turn for that right mm. i feel like someone wants to stop you group one or you're or it's the other way around it's one of the two or you're observing somebody getting this shut done what a, whichever one you can picture right but that's just all there is to it so now we're gonna move on to group two all right Happy birthday to y'all, by the way, Virgo. It is your season, after all. Don't let the moon and cancer give you anxiety. Because <laughs> that will happen, too. Okay. You all move all the hair. Thank you very kindly. All right, group two, let's see what's going on with you. What's your side of the story? Eh, eh. Should have put some arches through here, but like that would require me to measure. Might do that later. But I need to find symbols to go into these corners too, and I haven't decided what symbols I want to use yet. All right, group one, you got some shady shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're going this route. Okay. And the situation is your options are pretty confusing right now, actually. Extremely confusing, group two. Um, what you want and wish for is to get the fuck out of the cold. Let be back into the warms. Your obstacle and challenge is trying to find a way of doing that. Uh, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Hmm weird, but okay. Fears and rejections right now. The high priestess, there's something you know, but you ain't letting your mouth open about it. And what starts this shit and how it'll end could be Virgo right here. Virgo, if this is you after all, you might not be making an offer to this son of a bitch. There might be something that you know, but you're not letting anybody else know about it, which is not a bad thing. And they have group two, the five of cups. Someone got knocked over, and now someone's upset because there's spilt milk everywhere. At least they didn't let it dry all over the fucking floor. That is vital and important. Okay, let's see. What is going on with your side, group two? La 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 la
kit 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 in. Trying to get on my lap. Trying to get on my lap. Okay. Group two. Hmm. There's some sneaky sneaks. You're trying to carry all of your sneakiness away elsewhere. Uh, almost like you're trying to drag that shit back to the past, right? But your obstacle and challenge is trying to snoop for something or look up some information or just spy in general. Might be looking on social media, might be looking on um, people's shit for no reason other than the fact that, I don't know, you think that there's going to be something of value you can find there, right? Sorry, Gretchen. I don't know how you... When did you turn? Well, Gretchen's definitely looking at these five of cups and praying for it, you know. Cora's just looking at whatever, which is crazy because she don't have eyeballs, but we can pretend. Um, okay, like, I know you, Virgo, you've been dealing with the water sign, is it like cancer? Because <laughs> this person's kind of hostile, I feel like. Or whoever it is that group two is dealing with or is, they are a hostile person, right? They want information because there's stuff that they don't know that's getting downloaded to somebody. They're trying to figure out what this person knows. Uh, there's really no options being given on how to come back in from the cold. And this person is not delivering something. Like they, they, they're thinking about shit, but they're not coming anywhere near the spot because it's just like, oh, wait up, motherfucker. No, 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 no. I know something, and that's why I'm not coming anywhere towards you. Mind you, once again, that could be you, Virgo. Hmm. The Seven of Swords, right? Group two. You got some sneaky sneaks. You got some snakes and swords in a box. And there is someone isn't waking up. Someone isn't changing. There's bad judgment. Someone isn't um, looking at shit the way it is correctly. Someone doesn't have discernment in their brain or whatever, right? Uh, <laughs> could be this King of Cups right here. Water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, once again. Hmm. This is supposed to be your energy group, too. So, you might have the, like, you're sneaking away with shit, but you have the wrong judgment call when it comes to being somebody who's a sage, I feel like. Your options are shit. Let's look at those. I need to get that water on. Uh, yeah, you're, you're, ha you, like, you don't know what your options are because nothing here is really balanced out. Libra's card. I don't know why Libra's always, um, reversed on these cards. I've never understood that at all. Like, that's just weird, but that's just how they're made. Anyway. But yeah, someone isn't coming to any, like, poise. They aren't really balancing stuff out in order to know what the options are and shit. Ah! And they're kind of being a stink butt because they're not getting their way. They're not dominating the way they think that they should in this regard. Group two. That's the situation right here. This person wants mastery and domination, but it's like... The way they're getting it is going like a page or a princess. If this is the same person, I feel like, hi, kitten. Now you getting on my lap. Let's go around and take a nap. We're gonna take a nap on mommy's lap. Lap, lap, lap. Because she just got here. No, that's my good little girl. Here, bless these. That's my good girls. That's my good girls. Okay. But yeah, it's like, um... This person's kind of... It's almost like group two is throwing a fit. Or whoever you're dealing... Or whoever you're dealing with in this group two, they're, they're throwing a fit and acting like an immature butthead. Ugh, ugh. <laughs> Sorry, every time I say butthead, it, 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 that has to come out. Like, I grew up when MTV, like, used to play music, so, you know. Five of coins reversed. Someone wants to come back in from the cold. They've been out there long enough. Unfortunately, they have not reaped anything. It's like this person hasn't, this person hasn't learned. The judgment card says that they have not learned to be the sage or whatever it is. Or learn how to actually stand in their divinity. Right? They haven't reaped any rewards from that. And that's why there was a separation. It was just like, they don't get it. They don't get it. And now they're throwing a fight like they should. Ooh. Yeah, you're still reversed. Ah. Sorry, kitten. Like, I'm doing my jobs. Mm -hmm. All right. 
Prince is a sword, right? And this is, like, really fucking interesting. Um, this person was the spy. This is the obstacle and challenge right here for you, Gertrude. This person was the spy to snoop or whatever, but it's a waste of fucking time. They aren't evolving. They aren't transforming. They're just trying to find out what another person's doing. But it's a waste of their fucking time, because it's like, how is this supposed to help you? You know, um, you aren't coming to any sort of options. Everything's still a mystery to you. Your intention and hunger is all out of whack. And none of this is really bringing you any sort of happiness or helping you anywhere, group two. If this is you, or this is just somebody you're dealing with. Or you could be dealing with group one. It could be group four. It doesn't really matter. Let's see. Yeah, but it's not like this per. It, it, okay, this person's hard-headed and they're a fucking child. Group two. I feel like whoever it is, this is. If it's not you, it's the person you're dealing with. But it, it, it's definitely somebody who uh, does not get it. And that's why they're looking. They know that, like, there's something known. That's possibly why, Virgo, either you're not moving to them or they think you're not doing anything for them. But either way, this person has a mind of a fucking child. Like... They don't know what to do. They don't know how to balance any, anything out in order to know what to do. Uh, they're like they're obsessed with like having control. They're snooping, all immature, like with the princess. They're wasting everybody's time, and they still have nothing. They they haven't learned anything. Judgment even says that like that the people in group two have not learned anything. If we're anyone in group two, I'm sorry, but you know I, I just call shit how I see it. You know, and right now I'm seeing that like. Whoever is in group two, they, they don't get it. Or they're not, like, they're not really trying to get it. It's just like, group one, like, at least they were spying just to see if something actually would pop up that would affect them. And I think that's what Virgo is technically doing. It's like they're setting up a trap here. Which the seven of, which the seven of swords could also talk about as being a trap as well. Now, someone's getting downloads and not saying anything. This is the um, Fears of Rejection. The High Priestess and the Empress are both reversed. Um, someone is... A, okay, someone's acting like they're ignoring their intuition, but they're not. Like, they're picking it up loud and clear. But it's like they're purposely trying to forget it. They don't want things to change. With the Knight of Wands right here, right? Leo Sag Aries. Someone knows what's going on, but they're not really saying what's up. They're not allowing the shape shifting and change to go on. Alright, what well, started this shit, how it'll end. Prince of Pentacles, right? Someone did not find treasure. Just, they didn't discover something. Virgo, this could be you, and this is why you're probably not moving towards this Princess of Swords, who's all immature and shit. And now you want to go to take your discipline. Now this person's realizing, like, if this is you, Virgo, it's like you figure out there isn't anything here for you, and now you want to take your devotion and discipline elsewhere. I think I said that in group ones, too. What's the ending theme? The Emperor Reverse. God damn it! Both of these two have been showing up a lot in my readings. Not even just with this deck. But they've been showing up a fucking lot. It's like they're fucking connected or something. Which is crazy because it's like Aries. And this could easily be Libra or Gemini or Aquarius. But I would like to say more of like Libra. Because, you know, Libra is all poised and shit. They gotta look pretty all the goddamn time. You know, like, I need to be balanced with myself. And that balance requires me to be on my best and not look horrible. And it's, but it's like, that's it's not the case here. It's like somebody's just lost their fucking shit. So, Virgo, you're dealing with a control freak for sure. Like, someone wants to be an overlord and they're not getting in the way. They're kind of throwing a fit and all because they spilled their own cups. Whoever is dealing with all this shit, please be careful because I don't like this person. I think this person is untrustworthy. Especially with the King of Swords and the Emperor both reverse, this is an untrustworthy person. Like, that's my whole gig now. If I see either of these two in either of these positions, no matter where the fuck they are, there's somebody here who's got problems. Especially if both of them show up, you know? Very, very bad. 
very bad. Like I don't I don't like a person with this kind of energy at all, and they're here too. Ace of Wands, group two, you see a brand new beginning right here. And you want to offer your cup as the page of cups, but okay, well whatever. <laughs> um but you're restricting yourself for some reason. Or someone's holding your strength back from you and being like, hey, 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 you don't drink out of that goddamn water. No. I said, drop it. I said, drop it right now. <laughs> uh, they're trying to find different ways of getting in, though, or getting you the drink. It's like, look it. There's a whole thing of water right up there. Yeah, bitch, I hear you. I'm looking at a map right now. But look, if you just look, I'm looking at a map right now. Look it. We're trying to find a way to uh, Terabithia. What if Terabithia is that, that way? That is a floating island. Bitch. Okay. Um, so now this person definitely wants to uh, sabotage, I feel, with the five of swords. Coming in with some bullshit, right? Want to start some things. Once again, that fucking emperor's right here. Not trying to rest until, like, they get what they want. And they want control. They want the supremacy. They want to be overlord. And they will do anything with this king of swords right here reversed to get that shit. You know, in order to make their collection complete, I feel like. Whoa, Ditsy, calm down, dude. That, this is some... Oh, God. Ditsy's just dark today. And Malachite's just fucking dirty. Um, they got the wrong idea. This group, too, does. Right? Because they're mourning too much. They're not, like, allow... Like, they're not allowing themselves to recover to understand how things work. But they're not letting anybody else recover either. They might be drinking while they're making their fucking webs. Just flies go right the fuck through it. Right? Like, it's like an airplane. It's just a bus that flies. And it's like, that's how they're drunk they are. They say ridiculous shit like that. Yeah. Uh, very upset that there's no movement going on, too. I feel like they're sad because nothing fa worked out. They should have just put their pentacles in to begin with. But instead, now there's like a separation with everybody. Last card. And they should have made a fucking actual decision, I feel like, with group two. So, that's the reading. Virgo for your bonus, right? Group two makes me a little bit mm. like I, I like this. I don't like at all. I'm starting not to like this pair together the way it is. Doesn't even like if, if he's upright, it's okay. But if he's reversed, there's already something wrong. And if they're both reverse, there's something up here, right? But that's the reading I got for you, Virgo. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe. Up to you, really. No pressure, of course. I would greatly appreciate it. I love y'all's faces. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Goodbye.